Hey guys, this is Farjana. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create vertical tabs in DVT. So in this tutorial, we are going to achieve this design for tabs module. So let's dive into it and let's get started. First, I'm creating a new page from here named tabs module and publish it. Then I'm going to use DV Builder. Start building. I'm taking a single column and here taking tabs module. Here is the default style by DV for tabs module. Now I'm adding here some more style to make it uh, looks better. So I'm going to design tab and from here I'm going to tabs and for active tabs background I'm adding background color to the dark color and text color to white and now I'm going to advanced tab and custom CSS options from here I'm going to tabs module here I'm going to add some detailed CSS I'm going to tabs width to 50% so here two tabs uh, taking full width here is a uh, first tab and here is second tab so here is two tabs so I take it here 50% width so when we have uh, here three tabs we will take here 33.33 so it's taking three columns area and it looks better and from here I am adding some text style for tab I'm adding here tab font style to uppercase and tab letter spacing to one pixel and text color to a dark color and it's okay for now we can add here more style as we need so I'm just uh, going with this and now I'm just going to duplicate this tabs module and here I will try to make our tabs header area particle align. So for this I need to add some CSS here. I'm going to settings and going to advance. From here I'm clicking on custom CSS. Now here I need to add some CSS. I'm adding display flex and flex direction to row okay so we already see it's uh, vertically aligned but here is some more spacing on right side so here i need to make this tabs width to 100 percent so i'm making this width to 100 percent and here we can skip this border and we can also add border with this tabs item so First, I'm going to add border with these tabs. Border, one pixel solid, and color is E E E. Okay, and here, first, I'm trying with some more content here. If I add here more content, we can see just duplicating it. So here is some more space if you like uh, this style you can go with this or if you want to remove this border you can also remove it from here going to sorry going to design tab and going to border and from here you can also make it zero so it will be looks like this or you can also keep this border for now you can add here more style from here or you can also add more style using CSS so here is more options you can do now I'm going to save it and fresh my page so here is our tabs module style here is all for today if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and if you have more questions about this Feel free to comment below. Don't forget to subscribe my channel.
Thank you and welcome to my next tutorial.